The Space Program 2040 is a satellite development and launch program of the Space and Upper Atmosphere Research Commission Suparco, Pakistan's Supreme Space Research Authority. The Space Program 2040 intends to replace the Badr Satellite Program and Geostationary Communication Satellite. On the 11th of August, Poxet IR was launched from Xichang Satellite Launch Center by China, making it first satellite to be launched under this program. According to Suparco, five geo satellites and six low Earth orbit (LEO) satellites will be launched between 2011 and 2040. The stated goals of the program are expected to gain significant experience in satellite development, practicing of space medicine, and to promote socio-economic sector in the country. While the program intends to learn to develop the military and space technologies and to conduct experiments on fundamental sciences in space frontier, the government maintained that Space Program 2040's prime purpose is to bring the benefits of the full spectrum of space technology to the people of Pakistan. On 15 July 2011, Prime Minister Yusuf Jalani gave official approval of the program with the 2011 Pakistan Fiscal Year Budget. Topic. Space Program The Space Program 2040 included the development of five GEO satellites and six LEO satellites to replace Suparco's existing satellites in the orbit. There are no plans for development of a launch vehicle, and the program is entirely intended to launch more communication and remote sensing satellites from other countries. In the 11th of August, the Suparco launched the Poxet IR, as first satellite as part of this program. Topic. Geo satellites According to Suparco, the space program intends to launch five geo satellites from 2011 till 2040. Here the details are given. Topic. Poxet IE The Poxet IE was country's first geo-satellite that was operated by the Suparco. Previously owned by Boeing and operated under lease by Poxet. It was launched on 31 January 1996 and leased to Suparco in 2003. Since then, Suparco initiated to develop its own geo-satellite program, financed by People's Republic of China. The satellite will be replaced by its advanced and upgrade satellite, the Poxet IR. Topic. Poxet IR The Poxet IR is a first geo-satellite that was launched at 21.17 hours of August as part of this program from People's Republic of China. Its satellite vehicle was the Long March 3E carrier rocket from the Xichang Satellite Launch Center in China's Sichuan Province. The China Aerospace Science and Technology Corporation and the Suparco was the main contractor to build Poxet IR, and Desto was selected to build the primary heat shield and electronic materials for the spacecraft. The Poxet IR objectives are to support all conventional and modern fixed satellite service FSS applications, with a total of 30 communication transponders 12 in C-band and 18 in Ku-band. The geo-satellites that are under development or proposed are listed below. Poxet MM1 Poxet MM2 Poxet 2 Topic. Low Earth orbit In 1992, Suparco launched her first LEO project, and it was completed in 1996. Badr 2 was Suparco's first LEO satellite and was launched in 2001 by Baikonur Cosmodrome by the Russian Space Agency. Since then, Suparco took initiatives to replace her first Suparco satellite, therefore, remote sensing satellite program in January 2007. Topic. Optical satellite Suparco plans to launch her first optical satellite in the end year of 2011 from People's Republic of China. The satellite is reported to have payload of 2.5 meter pan in 700 kilometers in SSO. 
It is the first satellite that is locally manufactured by the SUPARCO and to meet the national and international user requirements in the field of satellite imagery. Topic. Remote sensing program There are six remote sensing satellites are expected to be developed and launched under this program. SUPARCO is intending to launch her first remote sensing satellite in 2018 and it is named as PRSS-01. According to SUPARCO, the planned and manufactured satellites are list below. PRSS-01 PRSSS-1 PRSS-02 PRSSS-2 PRSS-03 PRSSS-3 